man, we got along really well in first season. I was like, why don't, why don't we, we should work together. <laughs> yeah, no, so, yeah, I was trying to figure yeah. it out, you know. <laughs> Same yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll have my guys call your guys. Yeah, yeah, do that. But, yeah. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, no, season two, we get some time together, which is really nice. Nice to meet you guys. Likewise. Nice to meet you. Well, um, it looks like we may have a little bit of a love triangle going on between you three this season. What? Um, uh, yes. Yeah. <laughs> um, Emerald, if you would like to start, if you could just kind of say, where is Lily's head at when we get to see her again? How yes. complicated is this? Lily is kind of starting from rock bottom in this uh, in this season, I guess, you know, and navigating her life again, trying to find out what love means to her, what love is. Um, also like, I love it cause all my girlfriends and myself relate to Lily. We're a little messy. We're trying to find love, our career, societal expectations, family expectations. So where do we find ourselves? Where do we find our happy medium? And I think so many women are struggling with that of like, how do we, what makes us happy, you know? So, um, I think that's a journey that Lily's going through and I'm really excited for everyone to to relate to that journey. Well, Rome, and of course, Desmond, you can chime in on this one as well, but are Santiago and Nick going to have any scenes together this season? Because I mean, yeah, they're I mean, their love here. So <laughs> That's actually the storyline. Um, so Santiago and um, Nick, that's where the triangle is. Mm-hmm. And so Emirat's on the outside of that. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, the, the real outside. relationship right here. And that, that's really what's happening. <laughs> You got to really see under the subtext and a lot. You it's, know, it's the stash you know, that's attention. happening right now. That's what it is. That's listen. We're we're, we're facial hair brothers bonding. Yeah, you know. <laughs> uh, no, yeah, you know. It's, it's 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 always interesting to play this these sort of things where you're in between. You know, it sucks when you're on the opposite end where you're not that guy. And so I think we do we do get some of that too. Hmm. Yeah, we we do finally get to have a a few scenes together, which is really nice. Because like, man, we got along really well in first season. I was like, why don't why don't we? We should work together. <laughs> yeah, no, so, yeah, I was trying to figure yeah. it out. You know, <laughs> same yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll have my guys call your guys. Yeah, yeah, do that. But uh, <laughs> but yeah, no, season two we get some time together, which is really nice. Uh, you know, it's 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 not to give anything away, but it's a tense scene, and uh, I think that's it was it was fun. Well, Lily was honest with Nick last season that, you know, even though she cares about him, she's she's not she wasn't in love with him. But does does he believe that there's a part of her that maybe doesn't realize it because they've been friends for so long? I think he's just smart enough. I think he's just smart enough to believe it. I think he's naive and idealistic enough to hope for the opposite. I think he hopes that there is a part that 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 is still open to the idea. Um, You know, I think I think he thinks he's moved on. Uh, he shall find out, in fact, that that is not true. Um, and that's part of his story of growing up and getting in touch with those emotions, right? He's such a dumb face. He's such a dumb dude. And to see him become no. truly wise is is great. It's so nice to, to play it's like someone you know the saying, works. like, let, let love go. And if it comes back, it's meant to be, right? Right. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. This facade that that Lily's parents put on for their kids is really what shaped what she thought a relationship was supposed to look like her whole life. So now that that fantasy has kind of been shattered, how might this kind of change how she approaches love and romance this season? Yeah, you know, I think like two things are being in debate on the show. It's like um, when things are meant to be, what is it like? Um what is the word uh, when things are meant to be um, fated, serendipity, fate, like fate you know, yeah. versus actually doing the work and doubling down on your partner. So what do you believe in? Right. Do you believe in fate that God just kind of or the universe kind of puts everything in your path and you're supposed to kind of just fall into it? Or are you supposed to work to get it? So I feel that is what Lily is juggling on, like what what's supposed to happen with her life. Oh, what are you each most excited about for fans to see this season? Anything that you can tease coming up for your character? Episode two, the opening. Always the opening of season of episode two, season one, and now season two is just going to be very sexy. And let's just say Lily fulfills a little bit of her fantasies. That's what I'm most excited for everyone to see. <laughs> I actually haven't seen the second episode. What? What? Wait, it is episode two, scene one. Oh, oh, yes. Yeah, people are gonna love. It's, okay, it's, it's, I'm, I'm dream, gonna give it away. Right? Yes, 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 yes. I'm not gonna give it away. People are gonna freaking love that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we're being so coy. 
Yeah. <laughs> cool. Awesome. It looks like it is time for me to wrap. But thank you guys so much for chatting with me about the show. Thank yeah. you. Thank you. Bye. Bye.